Mitt Romney made sure that you know who will go down in history as the first impeached president who did not get a unanimous acquittal from his own party. He said the oath he swore to God made him cast the lone Republican vote against it. Take a look. I am profoundly religious. My faith is at the heart of who I am. I knew from the outset that being tasked with judging the president, the leader of my own party, would be the most difficult decision I have ever faced. Corrupting an election to keep oneself in office is perhaps the most abusive and destructive violation of one's oath of office that I can imagine. I'm aware that there are people in my party and in my state who will strenu strenuously disapprove of my decision. And in some quarters, I will be vehemently denounced. Oh, yeah. He's right. And Republicans have already gone on the attack. Junior tweeted that he should be expelled from the party. What are you, this is a school? <laughs> <laughs> what a detention. You're expelled, you're out. And his dad is expected to come for Romney at a noon press conference. And, you know, how, how is this going to impact his future? Because I have to say, he is his father's son. You always want... You want to see a shining moment. And, you know, George... Uh, George, for, George uh, yeah, yeah, his dad, first supported the Vietnam War, but after a 1965 trip there, he felt he'd been brainwashed and said so out loud. August 1967, he openly opposed the war. He also stood in front of the convention that nominated Barry Goldwater in 1964 and decried the party's turn towards extremism. And all of these, of course, have affected, you know, have affected him. And now mm -hmm. his kid, who, you know, people call him the flip-flopper. He goes this way, he goes that way. His last stuff, you know, he stood for... <laughs> he's standing for the country and not for the party. And I, I have to say, you know, I, I'm never... He and I are probably never, ever going to agree. And every time I say something nice about him, it freaks him out. So... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm, you know... I'm glad someone from that side stood up and said, you know, I, this is not right. I don't think this is right. I, yeah. So, thank you. Thank you. Right. Thank well, you. I may, I may have to take back every joke I ever made about Romney. <laughs> and, I, you know, I, this is going to... And, and talking about the son is like the father, that's Junior. is just like his father. Yeah. Junior, yeah. Uh, Donald Junior. Yeah. I mean, so much... Genetics plays a big part in politics, apparently. <laughs> and also, um, I mean, Trump already attacked his religion at a prayer breakfast. I mean... Yes, he's so, I know. He's so creative. And, uh, <laughs> and, and watch for the retaliation now. I'm expecting Trump will be nuking Utah. Just watch. Yeah. Because now he's on the attack, the attack against anybody, anybody who said anything against his... That's not a good sign. Call. That's not, not a good, good sign. sign. Uh -huh. I mean, Susan Collins thought that he'd learned his lesson. He would never do anything again. And he just... I don't know if anybody's looking at the news, but he just pulled uh, from, from New York, uh, you know, global <coughs> entry from New York because yeah. he says it's a sanctuary uh, city. So it's, it's just unbelievable. What I, what I found... Um, Nobody flies into another sanctuary city? This is the no. only one? I mean, I'm sure California is next, right? Because, yeah. because he's vindictive. He's an, a vindictive Well, we'll see what happens in the person. courts. I'm sure somebody will say, wait a minute, yeah. I don't know if you can do yeah, because well, it's retaliatory. Um, but I, I, what I found um, interesting, what spoke to me at least, is because people know that I'm a person of faith as well, and, and some people would disagree with mixing politics and faith. But he leaned on that, and he Who said, did? Uh, uh, Mitt Romney. Oh, he I said, as a person, Trump. Uh, no, he I did not mean that. <laughs> no. Um, even though he, he does say that he's a person of faith. Yeah. Um, I'm not questioning his faith. Yeah. But uh, Mitt Romney said that he is... Uh, he leaned on his faith. And in, in looking at it through that lens, which is his lens, he, he could find no other vote but to vote to convict. And I think, you know, we, we heard a lot of Republicans say that this was a partisan impeachment. Well, Mitt Romney made it a bipartisan I know. impeachment. <laughs> he did. And, um... Senator Romney now becomes the first senator in American history to vote to remove a president of his own party yeah. in a Senate impeachment trial. The first yeah. senator in American the history.